Welcome to Serenity Productions. Just wait outside, okay? Like, Etia, I know you want to be in there with me, but I need to handle this one on my own. I don't know why she's here, okay? And yes, I love my mother, but our relationship has always been a tad bit contentious. <laughs> Lagartia. Hey, let me finish. You can't come in there with me, but... Here, put these on. It's connected to the earrings I'm wearing so you can see and hear everything I am. So I might be in there alone, but I won't be completely alone. Okay? Okay. I'll be out soon, all right? Hey, don't worry. She's just my mother. She's not gonna kill me. I hope. It's a joke. Relax. I'll get this done soon, and then hopefully you can just chill for the rest of the night. Hellion, maybe she even knows something that'll make all of our lives easier. <sighs> ah, Cypher. I was wondering how long you are going to keep me waiting. I do too, Mom. Hello, my daughter. So what, it's been like three years? I am not sure. You know banshees don't keep track of time like that. Right, how could I forget? Cypher, please, the tone is unnecessary. There was no tone, Mother, just... <sighs> it's been a while. We've missed you at the Soul Sisters down in PR. I am sorry I couldn't attend. I did tell your father that I would be busy. Yeah, I know. He does miss you. I miss him. He really is something else. His jokes, the way he used to pull me onto the dance floor. <laughs> and suddenly I have that feeling of ick most kids get when their parents get all lovey-dovey with each other. But I haven't had the time, Cypher. The balance does not pause for a simple lover's trip. Of course. Still, you should go down and see him. I am sure he has moved on by now, my love. And I wouldn't blame him for it. I wouldn't be so sure. You have always been the one that could hold Dad down. He was the same for me. So I'm guessing you're not here to catch up on family stuff. Are you going to tell me why I'm getting hello now after years of not seeing you? You know why. This is what the issue which you and your... friends have failed to contain. Well, if you haven't noticed, we've been on short staff. I'm sorry, little army of about ten people is not adequate for you. I am not talking about the Wraith, Cypher. Though that is a concerning thought in and of itself. Even we are having trouble keeping them back. So if it's not the infestation of the race, what are you talking about? Because if it's the wedding, I didn't think banshees cared about human and vampire marriages. I am talking about the girl. Eve? Yes. The vessel. The elders want to know why she hasn't been taken care of yet. Excuse me? You must sense it, Cypher. She is a disruption to the balance. A twisted thing that does not adhere to the laws of nature now. They believe she must be dealt with or worse things could come of it. I hope you're not actually suggesting I kill one of my best friends. I am not suggesting. I am telling you that's what they decided must be done. Fuck no. Besides the fact that I would never allow you to lay a finger on her... 
you would have to get through everyone in this entire castle, including a dragon hybrid. I understand, and we are prepared for that. We? <laughs> oh, I get it. This is the elders just being the elders again. Instead of trying to understand something new, they're just taking the brute force way again, huh? You know they are right, Cypher. They know more than most. If they say the balance is going to break because of your friend- They're not always right, Mother. They're not right about killing Eve. They're not right to still keep the Banshees excluded from the rest of society. And they definitely weren't right about me. Cypher- How can you so blindly follow them right now? There is a girl, my friend, who's scared out of her mind right now. Her family is scared for her, her mate is scared for her, and instead of wanting to figure out a way to help her, your offer is just to kill her. It is the only way to keep the balance right now. And that is the only thing that matters. The balance is what keeps life going. Keeps all of this from falling apart. Without the balance, there is nothing. Is that not something worth sacrificing for? You have no idea what will happen if you go through with it. The elders know that this is the best option. And I must do as they say I don't have a choice. Gonyo, mama. English cipher. Here, let me translate. Shit, mom. Don't you see how wrong this is? If the elders decree it... Fuck the elders. Why do you still so blindly follow them? After what they did to me. After what they put your own daughter through. It was all to help you grow accustomed to the Banshee culture. You are a Banshee, Cypher. I was trying to help you get in touch with that side of yourself. I'm also half Siren. I know your elders hate that, but it's true. That's what I am. And I'm not going to let you hurt my friend. So if you try anything, I will lock your ass in a cell. Cypher, don't be ridiculous. I am your mother. Then act like it. And don't give me some bullshit order. Help me. Help my friends. I don't know how. I don't know how, my love. As soon as I heard about your plight, I looked into every book we had. Every history we documented, I went through all my contacts to try and come to you with a solution. But anything we might have had has been lost to the ages. And by the time I went to the elders, they had already decided. I wanted to come to you with a solution. I wanted to come with answers. But this is all I come with, my love. It's the Elder's decision. Did you even try to fight it? Of course I did. I don't agree with this at all. It's not Eve's time. But her fate has been corrupted by this rune, and we don't know why. The balance calls for her end. For the rune's end, everything else is moot. So you don't think she can be saved? If it's a possibility, the elders don't want to explore it for fear that we may run out of time. Then go back and tell them they're crazy! That I won't do it and that I will fight every step of the god's damn way and I won't be alone. Cypher. Mother, you will have to decide. You can either side with me, or you could side with them, but there is no compromise. And I love that girl like she's my sister, and I will not let you harm her. I will let the maids know that for now, you're a guest. But even step foot near Eve, and I will tell Fangs to lock you up. You weren't the best mother when I was growing up, Mom. But you didn't know how to be, and I forgive you for that. Do not do something that I will never be able to forgive you for now. 
Let's go, Lagartia. Cypher! <laughs> Lagartia? No. Just... Let's just go. Please. I'll come and see you in a few days, Mom. Just give me a few days to show you that killing Eve is not the answer here. I can give you a week, Cypher. Nothing more. That's all I need. We need to tell Eve and Sasha what's going on. And Eris. And Fangs. And probably Fangs' mom. And... Because on top of everything, the universe had to put the Banshee Elders on our plate too. I'm fine. Lagardia, there's a whole bunch of banshee politics you do not know what's going on in the background. I want to be so quick to judge my mother for the position she's taking right now. I just... I need to calm down after everything, and I need to get my head on straight, because right now, I need to put a case together for my best friend. And not lose my mind over it. And I need you to not lose your mind over it either. So we are both going to have to just swallow this right now, tell the girls, and fangs. And after that, we'll figure this out. Everything out. Just... I wish I knew a way to stop time. All right, time to go save Eve from a bunch of fucking elder banshees. She's gonna love being the damsel in distress again. Fuck. <laughs>